This has been a this memorable has been a year. Memorable this, has year. Been this, has been this has been a memorable, been a memorable year. year. This has been a memorable year. In spring of 2019, when the Christian Education Committee named discernment as the theme for this year, none of us knew how true that would be. As we studied Ezekiel in our summer Bible study, exploring how the prophet discerned God's truth in the midst of wild and dramatic visions, we learned how God speaks to us in our present moment. This year, we experimented with a new staffing model, employing part-time pastoral assistants rather than a full-time assistant pastor. We are continuing this model as it is filled with blessings. A visioning team prayerfully discerned God's will over a period of months and wrote a strategic plan to guide us in the next five years. In order to deepen our connection with God, our neighbors, and each other, we will continue our strong support of the Sunday morning worship service at Duke Chapel and work to strengthen the ministry to welcome and hospitality. We will continue a robust offering of year-round Christian education and develop a ministry of small groups to strengthen individual and corporate discipleship. We will continue to provide generous support for our partner agencies in Durham. While being more intentional in our efforts to connect with university students who are our most immediate neighbors. We will continue to offer loving care to one another in person while also using technology to enhance our connections with one another. In February of 2020, Nelson Struther completed his work with the congregation as financial and IT administrator. We're grateful for his past service to the congregation as a staff member and pleased that he continues as a valued and active member of the congregation. While the changes above required prayerful discernment of God's will by many, we were all surprised by the need to quickly discern God's will in responding to the COVID-19 pandemic. With incredible grace and wisdom, members of the congregation adapted to the online classes and meetings. Experimented with online fellowship, offered and received comfort by reaching out to each other, accepted the reality of live streamed worship, and called its first ever virtual annual business meeting. Through it all, God's presence was evident. The congregation continues to be faithful in the midst of this pivotal event. As we prepare to celebrate our 35th anniversary as a congregation in the fall of 2020, we continue to affirm our mission and vision statement, which was slightly modified through our strategic planning process and now reads, Believing that God reaches out to us with love and forgiveness, we seek to grow together in faith through worship, study, service, and our life together, to the end that we embody Christ's compassion and holiness. God is leading and guiding us as the body of Christ. As we give thanks for the past year, we also look forward with hope to the joy of reuniting in person, the privilege of serving our Lord in this place, and the wonder of knowing God's abundant grace. This has been a this memorable, has been a memorable year. year. This has been a memorable year. This has been a memorable year.